Taryn and Michael, the love you share has been a growing blessing in your lives that we pray will grow and flower as the years go by. Each of you wants to make this dearest friend your partner in life with a sacred commitment to care for one another in every way through whatever may come. Taryn loves you and appreciates your positive, considerate support and care and respects your devotion to duty. Michael feels you really understand him, bring out the best in him, and both of you see in each other the makings of a wonderful parent for your future family. The joy you feel today in finally coming to this precious moment is a memory we hope you will touch often and that it will awaken a tenderness for each other that will carry you through many of the challenges life will surely put before you. Marriage is not something once and for all said and done, but a promise whose fulfillment is acted out one day at a time as a little seed day by day may grow into a mighty tree. As strong and solid as trees may seem, when you break the glass in a moment, you bring to mind the fragility of life the many ways in which life and love are fragile. This is a charmed moment here under the canopy, a little patch of the Garden of Eden, and you are the first man and woman who ever fell in love and began a life together. But in a moment, tomorrow, you'll be gone from here, and you'll be out in the ordinary world where you've already tasted some of the challenges couples face. And so when you break the glass, you break the spell, and you remind us all of the courage you're showing in setting out to make a life together. We can only look on with prayers and good wishes. May God bless you and keep you. May God show you favor and be gracious to you. May God be kind to you and grant you peace. May God bless you so that in constant renewal of love to each other, you establish a home filled with the spirit of trust, faith, truth, and love. Amen. There are two rituals which will follow this ceremony that are an integral part of the wedding. In order to more fully experience the fact of actually being married, the couple will spend a few minutes alone immediately following the ceremony. This is called Yichud, it means union. After that comes the wedding feast. It is the responsibility of guests at a wedding feast to see that the bride and groom rejoice. You've had your instructions. I expect you to take your responsibility seriously. <laughs> Stop and move her veil. Thank you. Wait. <laughs> You've got good reflexes. <laughs> and now. <laughs> Since both of you have joined voluntarily in this ceremony, which binds you together in marriage, abiding by the laws of the state of California, and acting in accordance with tradition, you, Taryn, and you, Michael, are a husband and wife. Now. Yeah. 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 Yeah.